Okay, here we have a Rockwell Automation MPL motor with the hyperface interface. That is to say it's got sine and cosine one volt peak to peak signals providing the positional feedback in place of the traditional encoder. Um, the hyperface data lines themselves aren't being used in this application and we don't have any Hall commutation sensors either. So commutation is achieved purely on the encoder cos and sine wave signals. So right now you'll see it's powered down. If I just move that horizontally there so you can see the keyway. Uh, when I enable the drive, uh, so, enable the power, it's still powered down at the moment. The drive is going to go through a little sequence to enable it and it should twitch the motor to see where it is. There. Okay, hopefully you've just about caught that on camera. And now when I try to move it, it's locked. So in fact the shaft moved less than a degree, very small amount.